Greetings, and welcome back to Cosmeteer. I'm Catherine of Sky, and I've just kind of come from a very interesting play session I had with Tony. Um, he and I were just like playing solo games and just chatting as I do with friends. Um, and it was really kind of interesting to compare notes on how we build uh, ships. And I think I would like to change my ship um, to a different one. I have created a very interesting, um, well, a very interesting kind of ship. But what I do want to do is I do want, oh, we have money, money, give money, tasty. All right, let's get this one, destroy pirate base. That's six, that might be difficult. Mine parts, gold delivery. Okay, we just need 10 here. For 4,000, I think we can do that. 10 gold. Cool. Okay. Trade. That sounds great. Um, do they have any tri steel? I'm going to buy the tri steel as well. Tri steel is needed for a few different things, and we kind of want to stock up on a little bit of it if we can. Let's see. What else do we have here? Coils and hyper coils. We have a lot of hyper coils. We can even make more of these. So I'm going to go ahead and sell those. The steel. Let's go ahead and sell the steel as well for now. And the Hyperium. That seems great. Okay, cool. We can also uh, yeah, get the gold delivery. Fantastic. We're getting even more money. All right, let's go back to our other ship here. Um, yeah, wow. Okay, I updated my ship in this... Uh, in this new world order and it is so much better um so i want to kind of get back to that uh if you want to see what it looks like i would like to demonstrate it for you actually can we load shape ship load ship it's this one it looks like a lobster let's see can i load this here it is kind of a monster. It's pretty great. Um, I like it a lot. Uh, these are flashing because we don't have the blueprints yet. Um, but it has shields. It's got a rail gun. It's got all kinds of other stuff on it. I'm going to go ahead and turn this uh, off for now. Um, and we'll get there. But it does require a lot of different materials, including, I think it's like 35 tri steel. So let's go ahead and hail the station, see if they have any tri-steel here. Uh, oh, we can accept a whole bunch of new bounties. Some of these are also... We're not going to get any... Um, let's see, ammo delivery, it's not enough money. Oh, nice. Cool. We got a little bit of rep as well. Did we get any more people? Perfect. That's great. Well, not perfect. We'll get more. Don't worry. There will be more. More people. So coils, hypercoils, I'm going to hang on to those. Everything else looks really good right now. And, um, but we, oh, did they have tri-steel? I didn't even look. Jeez. Let's see. Do they have tri-steel? No, they do not. Okay. Let's hail the other ships. Because sometimes these folks have tri-steel. Nope. Oh, okay. Courier. Let's see. Do you guys have tri steel? Oh, they do 28. Holy fuzzy cats, that's great. Okay, let's take it. Fantastic. Uh, all right, so yeah, we got a lot of stuff here. I'm going to go ahead and grab the other ship. Let's see. Let's take this ship. Um, one of the things I do want to look at with the Sky Factory is we need to do a, a few modifications here. One of the most important things is getting this blueprint for the engine room. I think that's really good. It is very, very good. And a large reactor core, that is also really good, especially with our lack of people. Um, uranium enricher, ooh. That might be interesting. This one makes processors. I think this is for like when we have more money than God, really. Uh, the tri-steel smelter might be okay, but we don't actually get a lot of those materials. And it's going to be hard to make up that that amount of money, honestly. Okay, let's. we're in blueprint mode here. And what I would like to do is... Oh, whoops. 
is change this factory ship. I also, um, I know I did this off camera, but I practiced with this tractor beam. It does not work for, it doesn't suck up material. It's just basically for pushing ships around and stuff like that. So I'm going to go ahead and delete this because we don't need it. And what I'm going to do instead is we're going to, oh, come on, stop doing that. I, I just wanted to clear the cursor and it's like, nah, no, you're not allowed. Um, but, oh gosh, we also just sold all our stuff. So, you know what? I'm going to, let's go and uh, hunt some stuff down first. Um, let me get the defenses going and this, that looks good. And we'll delete this bit over here. And we are going to do a little bit of some different stuff here. Um, we need to definitely change how this thing is laid out, but yeah, we're, oh crap. Okay. Uh, er, okay. Go back and we will then go back here make it so, okay. 3000 is not too bad. Let's go ahead and go, uh, both of them. Actually, you know what? This ship can just go here. The F2, you go here and go and hunt these asteroid stuff down. I'm going to take my other ship and what we're going to do is we're going to try, we're going to look at this thing and see where we're actually going to get some, uh, this is money, but not uh, rep. We want to get rep ones if we can. Looks like level two is not giving us a lot of rep at all. This one is good. Pirate hunter. Let's do the star that one. These are going to be difficult because they're level six. And I think we need a little bit more for that. Um, but let's see. This one is also, though, no, that's not anything. This one. Okay. Eliminate pirates and defense platforms. But that's got four different enemies. And I think uh, it's better with, this, with another ship. So I guess we're just going to have to go for these money ones for now. Um, and maybe we'll pick up uh, enough stuff to kind of, you know, justify all of this stuff. So let's take our Avenging Angel out here and basically gather materials. So let's take this. Let's go. Our ship here is moving on. And honestly, I've been running the game mostly on eight times speed. I find this like eight times speed feels like it should be the base speed for travel. Honestly, wait. Oh boy. Don't, don't attack me. Oh no, 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 no. Stop. Stop. Oh, I can't move. He's going to kill my ship. No. Uh, I can't do anything. I can't move. The engines are dead. Oh, this is bad. You know what? You know what? <laughs> We're going to go here. We're going to go for an auto save. I know. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But we got to do it. We got to do it because I don't want to lose the ship. It's going to be way too expensive to replace. And um, replacing ships in this game is really not fun. It's very annoying. And okay, fifth. Uh, no. Oh. Oh no. Shoot. Okay. Whoops. It didn't do an auto save. <laughs> it didn't do an auto save. So I don't remember what I did. I think we traded some stuff. All right. Let's do the thing again. This is a little bit embarrassing sorry we apologize for the inconvenience oh dear oh dear oh dear hail as i recall none of those other things had tries whatever it is Let's see we can sell okay i think we're good here we were gonna get the yep engine room reactor the re reactor is very interesting. Okay, what we want... Are any of these going to give us... None of these give us... Okay, why can't we favorite them from this menu? I don't get that either. Okay, this one is good. Hooray. Uh, okay. So you... I want you to go to the next... Uh, Clear asteroid. No, that that's a dangerous one. Let's go down here. 
Okay, and that's fine. Now, let's go to the next ship. Yeah, this one, our sad, sad Sky Factory ship. All right, let's trade with you. We had much more interesting things to do with this one. Okay, then we can accept this one. We were doing the gold delivery, I think. It's 10 gold. Okay, yes, we'll take that. Uh, we're gonna hire, oh, let's hire the people on this ship. Why not? 10 gold, this one. And, oh, before we trade all this stuff away, I'm going to go ahead and redo the ship because that's what our problem was last time is I wanted to redo some things and we kind of ran out of stuff. So anyway, we decided to delete the tractor beam because that wasn't working for us very well. And here we have a reactor and I don't know why we have this reactor here. We also don't need two hyper thingies. So I'm going to delete one of those. And then... Let's put in a corridor in its place. Uh, one of the things I would like to do is move the wings out a bit. So I'm going to do that. Just grab these, cut, and do it symmetrically, and go one over. And the reason for that is I want to put in a walkway. What I also discovered about the moving walkways is that the only time they really don't work Oops, I keep pressing R because that's how we normally do things. The only time they don't work is if you have a door like this, people can't get out anymore. So that's bad. We don't want to do that. We want to delete these. Let's see. Can I delete that one? Yes. Okay. So that's perfect. But crossing, they just cross at normal speed. So you don't have to leave gaps or anything in them. Uh, all right, so I also want to put in an engine room here. That's important because what we can do with this engine room... Wait, why are we not engineing? There we are. Um, what we can do with the engine room is deliver the uh, fuel to the engine room directly. And we don't even have to have doors on these um, thingies. Not even from the engine room to the thrusters. And they give plus 50% bonus, which is kind of great. It's very great. Uh, we can also, I think, I don't know if we need an extra mining laser. I don't think we do. So I'm going to go ahead and take one of them off. They cost, if you look at this thing, 23. So that's a 23. If we take it off, it's now 18. They cost five people to have a mining laser. It's crazy. So I think we want to just have less mining lasers and have more people available to deliver stuff. Now, let's go ahead and keep on working with this. Let's move this over. And now we have a space here where we can put another small reactor or a big one if we like. Um, we might have a big one over here actually, a bigger one, and put the small one down here. Let's go ahead and put that one down here. Do we have, we don't have a lot of these enriched uranium things. Do we have any on the other ship? We have 30. Those are very expensive. So I'm going to go ahead and let's go, oh, no. Let's just go here and then go to the Sky Factory. Um, there we go. And let's go ahead and go back and keep designing the ship while the other ship is coming to us. So what we really want to do is have this reactor right next to the place where the stuff is delivered. Um, all right, so corridor here. And I think that's actually good. We can delete this as well, these doors. This can also be deleted, this stuff. And then we can put in the armor, a little bit of armor here. And maybe even, yep do a second layer there nice okay so there we go we have a small reactor here the other thing we can also do is put in a um, storage thing for energy which is the capacitor uh, so if we run out we have uh, stuff so I think we should move the door there oh no no stop mirroring stop it okay delete this and that now we can actually we can have a door over here you you don't always want too many doors because oops let's unpause this because you um it it helps the fire spread faster so we don't want fire to spread faster that's bad 
Um, all right, anyway, so we have this area here. What we could do is we could make the ship a little bit bigger if we wanted to. Uh, right now, it's not going to cost us that much. We are going to need some of this try, try stuff. Um, but right now, that's not necessarily needed. But I do want to have a reactor in this area. So let's go ahead and move some of these items to different spots. The airlock and there's a fire extinguisher here. So let's see what we can fit. Can we fit a medium reactor here? We certainly can. That might be a good thing to have right here. The large reactor though, it gives you triple capacity plasma batteries. And I really, I kind of want that. You know what, let's just put it here and deal with the other stuff in a bit. Uh, we also want a capacitor to store energy that's being made. Okay, let's see, these can be there uh, or not there because we can fit something else in this spot. Let me just add those. I'll just actually delete them, just delete them for now. We'll add them in a second because we need another set of uh, sleepy places, quarters. There we go. Okay, so we have 18 spots, suggested 18. We can add a little bit more if we want as well. Let's add one there. And okay, so we need a door here and there at a minimum. Um, we'll add one there as well. I think we're, this is actually pretty good. Do we want to add the other cargo containers? We have quite a lot of steel. Let's see, where is our other ship? Has, has it got, come here yet? No, it's still on its way. All right, we still need to get it on its way here. And um, I think it would be nice to add more uh, storage, but... Hmm. We could also add another thruster to this area, but it's going to cause more work for our people. I think it's probably just easier to cut the bottom part of the ship and add another layer. So let's just do this. Control X and then do one, two, three, and four. And then we'll select it again, this section at least. Copy it and then put that back in here. And then we delete these bits. Okay. And then we can even put extra crew quarters in there if we like. Let's see. We can put in these quarters. Uh, there. Okay. Very nice. So um, the only thing that we don't have here probably that is needed is an airlock. Let's add that. We can also add an airlock at the top here somewhere. Like here. We also want to add plenty of uh, fire extinguishers. Those are really important because <laughs> bad things can happen. Mm. Very bad things can happen. We don't want to be caught without them because they're pretty important. Okay, so we get the armor going as well. I guess we can look here to see how much stuff we have. Oh, it's on. I keep pausing it. I don't know how it gets paused. If it's like pausing automatically or it's me just being bad or something. I don't know. Uh, all right. So we need a lot of shielding over here. Now, Tony shared with me an interesting strategy he had with ships. Um, because the AI isn't very smart, it, um, it basically just targets the center of your ship a lot of times. And so if you have nothing in the direct center, then you're pretty much okay. Uh, here we could put in a shield. I don't think we need it because this ship is really not supposed to go into combat. Let's see. Is the other ship here yet? It is. Okay. I'm surprised it didn't add the steel and stuff that we had. Oh, whoops. Let's go here and this. Hello. Okay. How much is this going to cost us? 37,000. Holy fuzzy cats. Um, because what do we need? Insufficient tri seal. But we need to buy lots and lots of steel. So let's go ahead and gather steel instead. Let's save the game first. Let's, okay, good, good, good. Okay, and we're going to take these ships up in here, I think. 
See if we can do a little bit of farming. Please. Also, the AI with the ships can be extremely bad. Like, getting caught on rocks and random things. Also, if I want this ship to follow this one at a particular distance, I can just do that. And then I can just order one ship around and not have to, like, worry about that. So what we're doing is we're looking... For, oh, I forgot about the gold. Darn it. Okay. So let's take this copper. Oh, boy. Okay, this might be a bad thing. Might be a very bad thing. Okay, and we're just going to G this. I'm going to take the my main ship here. And maybe we need to... Oh, no, it's not going there. It's, it seems to be okay. Let's go ahead and just farm that stuff. And you go a little bit closer. The other thing we can do with these ships is adjust their crew. So what I want to do is we want to... Let's look at the red shirts. What I want to do is edit the role here. And the job priorities of a red shirt are going to be... Basically, go out and get stuff. Gather resources and salvage and mine. Um, they're also going to supply the mining laser with stuff. Okay? And I think that's basically that's everybody on the ship. Except we do want to have a new role. And these are going to be engineers. And, or engineer, I guess. So the job priorities on these folks are going to be supplying the engine with power. So not this, but like thrusters. Where are the thrusters? Cockpit. Yep. Small hyperdrive. Small thrusters. All the thrusters are going to be at 10. And what we need to do is designate some people. We can't just say like, ah, oh, yes, let's have five. What you need to do is click it and then click a... Uh, a habitation area and I don't know which ones have people in them okay that one does so we're gonna make this person an engineer and that's gonna be their job um, to do stuff all right let's get off of there and take both thingies and keep on going let's get some copper so basically I want this ship to just make stuff for me I want it to make coils and we want to generate lots of steel as well uh, we can also kill stuff with the other ship. Oh, whoops. That's right. That's why it's not fast. It's like, eh. Okay. G that one to death. And you can go over here and G this one to death. Ugh. Sometimes the camera drives me absolutely insane. It just keeps, like, bouncing around and it's, like, weird... It is not good. It is not good. Okay, we've run out of space on this ship. So we have to have the Sky Factory to get all the rest of the stuff here. And that's okay. We are used to this. Okay, there we go. And having the priorities on the crew members allows us to get through stuff a little bit faster for one. Oh, here we go. Oh, yeah, I hate that it does that with the camera I don't get it I really don't understand why it does this it's just annoying really really annoying all right let's go here I'm gonna go ahead and cut this one up and then our friends on this ship will pick it up okay very good oh wait we left from someone behind hello okay you're fine okay good 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 oh my god this has been a disaster a disaster Quel disaster. okay so we want to get like a thousand uh, plates here, steel plates. Here we go. Very nice. Very nice. Okay. Uh, there's lots more steel over here. All right. Let's see. Oh, it's pushing it around. Darn it. Also, I think I should just transfer some of the loot because... Loot. Haha! <laughs> transfer some of the materials. Oh, whoops, whoops, whoops. Hold on, hold on. Let's just go this way. 
Does that one... Oh, it's going away. Okay, that's fine. Those are kind of difficult to deal with, I guess. Or, well, I don't have to guess. It's just they are difficult to deal with because they run away from you, kind of. You have to be kind of in their path, I guess. Okay, Sky Factory. Let's go down here and G this. So this is going pretty well. Let's see, do we need to allocate more places for steel? That I don't know. We can just, uh, we can do it. Um, let's see, let's add these for steel here, just in case they are somethinging. Hyper coils are there, okay, that's fine. Regular coils are there. We can, we can readjust this as we see fit. Okay, hold on, hold on. We have scary times. Scary times, scary times. Let's see if we can just... Please turn the ship. Please meet the ship. Oh god. Okay, let's focus. Also, what we want to do here is... We want to make sure that our railgun is um changed also i didn't realize you could click these until what you have to do oh this is so some of the things in this game are so esoteric it drives me up the freaking wall like why would you do this this i think is default so i had to turn it off require control to select parts like if you didn't know that was a thing i didn't think you could select stuff you can turn stuff on and off. You can adjust stuff. Like here, I want it to fire at target only when we target stuff. I don't want it to fire as soon as we get to a spot. Also, this has no doors. Um, so I want to get this a door real quick. That I, I have left this without a door this whole time. I can't believe it. Anyway, um, that's why that shield isn't working. So let's see. We want to fire at... Yep, here. This is going to be fun. Let's see. Come on, railgun. Oh, no railgun? Hello? Oh, boy. Okay. We've got a little bit things. Anyway, um, this ship, are you done? Yeah, you're done. Okay, so go here, please. And I want to trade some stuff with this ship so that I don't have so much iron in the Avenging Angel. We need to get... Let's see, can I pick up anything here? Some. Just some. So here, you pick up all this junk, please. And also, I think we'll have the Angel give you stuff. Transfer resources. Just gonna go from this perspective. Uh, oh, we want to give you the uh, uranium as well. Yeah, get, take it, all of it. Oh, let's do this and then just transfer like I don't know, thirty back, so that we have enough to make missiles and stuff. So that's gonna be a nice transfer of goodies and stuff and things. There we go. Very, very nice. Okay, and this one is making stuff, gathering things and stuff. Perfect. And we can also put this back here. Oh, okay. Are we good? Are we done? Almost? Thinking about it? Maybe? Okay, just transferring a few different things there. We still need a little bit of, of, uh, I, of stuff here. Looks like we can go down here to get more iron. Let's see. Oh, that was quick. And we can G at this. And have our peeps pick it up. Nice. Okay, what is the trajectory of that ship? No, I don't think I can reach it. It's okay. No worries. Let's see. Let's go ahead and obliterate this patch here. 
kind of looked like it was coming up, and I'm like, okay, hold on, hold on. Yeah, now that we transferred some stuff, we can actually pick it up with the bigger crew as well. That's nice. Okay, hold on, hold on. Okay. Crew, come back. We're going to give this a target so that we get that railgun going. Let's see what happens here. Are we going to be able to turn? We did turn. Why has the railgun not fired? This is just chasing through the whole thingy. Just kill the engines, man. Oh! Wow. Uh, no, we don't want to do that. It actually killed my ship. Wow, that's ridiculous. Okay, that's not good. We're going to have to load a saved game. Okay, this was at 119. This is 129. That's kind of, I think, just before we started this battle. Um, that's scary. That's really terrifying. We might want to target all the weapons first on that uh, ship instead. Okay, what are we doing here? We are going to get this iron... But that ship, let's recall all the crew, because I think that was part of the problem. Let's turn the ship as well. Okay, it might be coming. Because if we don't have enough people to man all the guns and stuff, then we have issues. Okay, it is coming this way, maybe. Maybe not. Or maybe it's going to come back on the next pass or something. I don't know. The 848. Okay. I wonder if it's random if it comes or not. Pirate Hunter. Okay. Okay. Seems okay for now. Go ahead and send this to mine that asteroid as well. Ships shouldn't move so much. It's kind of wasting energy by doing that. There we go. Okay, we got all the copper from there. Wasn't a lot, to be fair. There's carbon down there. Grab some of that. Copper here. Okay, and then there's sulfur there, but we don't really need much sulfur. Oh, we can't pick it all up. Okay, can we pick it up with our original... Whoops, no. <sighs> okay, there we are. Alright, looking good. There's still a little bit here. So maybe what we can do is just... The... How are we doing over here? We are converting stuff, which is great. Kind of getting closer to those amounts that we need. Go ahead and transfer some more stuff. Wait. 
Okay, let's pause while we transfer resources. Okay. Iron, yes. Copper, yes. Carbon, yes. Okay, go. Oh. oh, it might actually fire at us. So we need to face that direction at least. Okay, it is trying to kill us. So let's try to kill it. Okay, I think we did a good job. Very nice. I don't know if we ended up transferring all the resources though. I guess we'll have to see. Here we go. Okay, we got that. So let's go closer in case there's still some trading going on. This should be enough to actually make the changes to our ship, the Sky Factory ship. Thank you, That that's beautiful. Yeah, we actually need to do this crazy ship dance. Mm-hmm, yes. Anyway, let's go ahead and do transfer the resources again. Um, especially the iron and copper. Yes, okay. Yeah, we're doing really well. We're doing really, really well here. And it's gonna be exciting that we can kinda actually get to finish this ship. It's still gonna cost us 2,000, but that's a far cry from whatever it was, 34,000 or something. That was a bit crazy. All right, and we're going to keep on converting those things. Let's see, are we are we working? Are we working? I think we're working. Looking good. Yeah, once we get it sorted, I think it's going to be a lot better. So let's see. This one, let's go ahead and transfer more resources there. Uh, just have all of it there. The copper, the carbon... I guess we can't do the oh here's the iron copper iron ah it's not letting me transfer the whole thing it's just being a pesky thing being very pesky uh we'll leave the processors here i guess mm, steel no i think we're good on everything else actually we could transfer the steel do we need to do that though yeah let's transfer all the steel for now This is so crazy that they're like bumping up against each other. It's so stupid. I don't really get it. Okay, so I think that's good. Wait, we... Oh, I forgot to repair the whole thing. Okay, there we go. So the Sky Factory is doing pretty well. We still need those try thingy thingies. Um, I am curious about... Let's go back to the station real quick and see if they have any there. I thought we just bought a whole bunch of try thingy thingies, didn't we? No? Oh, I forgot to buy them. Darn it. I think I forgot to buy them after we reloaded. That is sad times. Very sad times. Wait, what? Hello? Ah, it's the angel. There we go. Please come back home. Thank you. We'll go to the space station and hopefully they have that try, try, try steel, whatever it's called. Come on, chips, let's go. Mm, okay. I like to slow it down when we get to a station because sometimes if you pick up, you know, one of those uh, thingies. Let's see, hyper coils. 44, wow, that's a lot. Okay. 
enriched uranium. I think we have enough. So five or uranium 40 hypercoils. I think we have them on this ship. Yes. Okay. So let's, oh, no, not that, not that. Hail. Five uranium 40 hypercoils. Actually, I can do a fair few of those. Yeah, 12,000, sure, why not? Um, then we wanted to hail and see, do they have any more people for us? No, not yet. All right, so let's go ahead and also do this part of it. 20,000, we really need, wow, 24 hypercoils? We have the, what, why are we, what are we buying here? Try steel and steel. We need that much steel. 833. I'm really surprised by that. I think we can still make make a lot of it or or get it from somewhere else. So one of the things I forgot to buy is the tri steel. Whoops. So let's hail the station again and see if we can get some. Yes, we can. Five. Okay, it's something. More than nothing, that's good. That's a good thing. Um, is this Atatonseco station? Wow, that's complicated. Okay, we can get this payment. Excellent. So I think what we wanna do is we wanna get more steel. We still need steel. Really surprised by that. It's like, wow. We, I really just don't want to buy it outright because it's very expensive. Um, let's go this away. Wait, are both of the ships? Yeah, everybody's on board. I just wanted to make sure. Oh, wait. Huh? This one needed... You know what? I'm not going to even bother the uranium thing. We don't need it. It's fine. So the Sky Factory, I hope, is going to be keeping on... Let's see. Are you happy? Oh, all the places are full of steel, mostly. But I wish they would kind of stack stuff a bit better. Okay, let's keep on going here. And you can be... Getting one of these asteroids while we're waiting. You can actually go to this asteroid. Dig this one out. Okay. Is it coming this way? Sort of it is. I'll go and get it. Let's see. Let's just be very careful with this. I should look what the quick save button is. Yeah, this is looking like it's going to intercept us. Maybe. Maybe not. No. Okay. Uh, we don't have to. It's fine. Where's, what's that trajectory? Oh, this one is definitely going to. All right, we're preparing for battle. It's fine. Okay. Let's go. Like pause as soon as they get into range so that I can shoot their thingies. I think if we shoot for this, then we can kind of kill everything else. Oh boy. <laughs> Hello. Hello thingy thingy. That was nice. Let's see. Let's G all this stuff. I'm kind of scared to come into the middle of this because like I feel like oh okay what happened there. Wow not much repair needed. Uh, where's my other ship? Okay, still gathering stuff. 
Okay, they're good now. Let's go to this copper mine down here. Titanium. That's a rare material. Or try whatever it is. Okay, apparently I can't pick that up either. So this ship is... Yeah, it just needs to process stuff mostly. Lots of coils getting made and lots of hyper coils as well. Pretty nice. Good stuff. The factories are working, but we really just need more people to carry stuff around. That's the main issue we're having on our ships right now. It's all that stuff. Mm hmm. Hmm. That's really strange that it's not picking... Oh, there we go. This looks like it's mineable, but... It's like... Oh, there it goes. That was weird. This stuff, too. Like, why is this not... Because those are definitely... Weird. Okay, that's really weird. Okay, that ship... Actually, it might be intercepting us. Let's go toward it. Go ahead and save the game. Yes, yes, yes. Too many dialogues. Go away. It's coming in fast. Okay, let's shoot it. We have some shots, please. Can you please shoot it better than that? Okay, it's doing good now. Now we got the guns off. Yeah, when the rail gun finally decides to go off, it's a good thing. Those missiles are scary. Turn, turn, turn. Wow, okay. Go take the um, the other ship down here as well. Looks like we need a lot. No, not too much repair. Seems actually like a good design that we have. Maybe we don't need the new design. <laughs> it actually has a much better rail gun than the new design that I came up with. But yeah, so far this one is working well. And we're still kind of struggling with just, you know, getting um, this ship refitted. We're at 1,300 steel, which we should still be, you know, processing this stuff. What are we doing, though, here? Ah, the problem is the engines are too far. That's the main problem with this design. It's not good at all. Come on, stop warring with each other, please. Just, just pick up the stuff. Pick it up. There we go. So this is going to give us a lot of steel as well. And again, reduce our costs even further. I think we'll take, after this, we're going to take both ships to the station and then just push the button, I think. It's a better idea. Okay, are we ready? We are ready. Okay. Let's go. Back to... Atatonseco Station. That is a mouthful. Oh, but we don't have any of the steel stuff. Huh. Okay. Well, it'll be fine. Where is this one? Oh, that's that station there. Okay. 
Also, if you do groups, you have to press F1 twice. Normally games that I play that are like RTS-like, you don't have to press it twice. I, I understand that that's standard in StarCraft, but I've never played StarCraft. I play Anno and other things like this. Uh, let's go and pause. Uranium delivery. We have uranium. I think we should accept that one. Tritanium. Ten of that and ten of that. Okay, sure. Ten uranium. Let's see. Okay, and then let's get the other ship for ten tritanium. Not this. Hail. Also, I wish the hail was shorter. Like, I just want to instantly ban do we have tri steel yes we do take it buy all of it okay what else do we want here we have tons of steel i think we're going to just take this ship and move it slightly and do the thing just do the thing Make it so. Alright. Uh, no, actually, let's wait for the try, try stuff to come in. Because I think we're going to get enough so we don't have to pay extra. Okay, that looks fine now. Wait. Oh yeah, still 300 steel. I don't think we can actually hold a lot more steel, so we might as well just click it. Uh, we have all the rest of the stuff. I think it's good. Now we have an absolutely huge ship. This is crazy. So let's get more steel in these places here. And we can just... There we go. And then let's clear these here. Um... Why? Oh, did we forget the coils again? These were supposed to be coils. Okay, that's just fine. All right, so bigger ship, much bigger ship. This is better as well. Oh, I forgot to finish this section here, which I just wanted to add some armor here. Just to protect the engines in the back a bit from any kind of fire. And it's looking very, very good. Wait, what happened to the engines on the side here? I'm very confused by that. I, I didn't think they got deleted. No. I think we'll do this. Okay, there we go. All right. Sounds looks perfect. So it's kind of great. We got everything going. And having this near the engine room is absolutely perfect because they can just quickly move stuff from the reactor into the engine room. So that's good. Okay, so we did a thing. We improved the Sky Factory. And uh, yeah, that's pretty great. So I think we can... Hopefully our little guys will get to doing stuff now. I don't know why we have these little squares. No idea. See, this is our steel smelter. And I don't know why... They're not delivering stuff here because we have everything that I know about and it was working earlier. So I don't know why they, maybe they're just complaining that they don't have any, but then we have these people just walking around in their rooms. Like they should be delivering iron here. Oh, you know what happened? Oh, I see. I see. I made a mistake here. Made a bad mistake. All of these rooms don't have any doors. So that's definitely not ideal. We're going to add doors to those. We need to add doors to these as well. Okay. Everything is reachable. Okay. That's good. That was my bad planning. Happened when I cut these guys off so they had no doors. And then, yeah, that was not good. Actually, we should do doors this way as well. I think. There we go. So now... We're going to be able to keep on uh, doing the steel and all that kind of stuff. Perfect. So anyway, that is the story of the Sky Factory. I'm going to go ahead and let's see. If you are a content creator, you can remove the UI with Control-Shift-U. And then you can take a picture. 
And then you can say, thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other, and I'll see you next time.